Greetings again. Welcome to another cooking time with Matt. Now, today I'm doing chips and dot on this, which is uh, twice fried squash plantain. Not usually this cumbersome, but I'm giving time room for the camera. Fry until a can of golden. The uh, camera's not doing this any place here. Then I squash them, then I fry them again. The chips, of course, I just, well, I can twice fry them or single fry them. It's all good. Let's just turn the heat down just a smidgen. Right, so I like to let them dry in a bit of <coughs> kitchen towel. You can dry, you can let them drip dry just to get rid of the excess oil. And then I extract the plantain. Uh, you can see how they're nice and golden. So now, let's see if I can't bring out the magic of that colour. There we go. Perfect. Take some more, put them on the table. Now you can use your hand if you, if they're cold enough. You can use the back of a, a flat knife if you like. Dustly. I prefer not to get my hands too close to blades. Or if you've got a nice burger squasher thing, then you can use that. I squash them flat. I like to get them squashed reasonably flat because then they cook consistently. And you'll get to judge exactly how much to cook them based on personal preference. You've got weaker teeth you probably don't want to cook them up really crunchy because they could probably bust a filling but of course that's what you like you go for it find a good sized plantain will give enough dotones to feed a couple of people it's quite good depends how much you like your portions now if you wanted to make fungo, which is a shaped plantain dish. You take these tortones and you can uh, break them down into smaller chunks and I'll do that in another video. Got a tool. I think I've got them all. Good. Okay. It's back to go into the fire. You can minimise risk, of course, by using a spoon to do this. Don't do this. <clears throat> you might burn yourself. Oh. And as if by magic, we're joined by the magic of whining doggo. Dog does like his dot on this. 
family favourite. Just give them a little bit of a burst and then I shall throw in a bunch of chips to go in with that. Keith Floyd never had this issue, did he? Was it before Keith Floyd? Floyd on fish? Yeah. <laughs> Cook them and sell brown or as much as you like. working mine in batches. Anyway, that's all. Thanks for watching.